that sounds more like walleye fishing in spring music than the other stuff. This is Jason with Time in the Outdoors. Let's take a look at the drone conditions over on the Wolf River out of Fremont, and then down by Orahulu, and then finally we're going to take a look at Rainbow Park over in Oshkosh. All right, folks, here we are. We're flying out of the Webfooters boat launch that is just um, down a little bit in downtown Fremont. And we're just going to be flying out and taking a quick peek at this. Now, I'm unsure on what's valuable and what's not valuable for you guys and ladies out there that are fishing. But we're going to start off by just showing what the conditions look like. Maybe a little bit later we'll do that. Now, remember, I can't fly the drone as far as it can go or I want want to fly it I can only fly it uh, through the legal limits um, with the United States FAA and all those fun regulations that they throw at me all right so to make this simple we are just going to be showing you the rivers we're going to have upstream and downstream as our direction so this would have been looking upstream on the Wolf River um, and now we are going to be looking downstream downstream is the direction your boat will go if you do not have the motor running or you have your trolling motor turned off so you will float downstream. Uh, not insulting anyone's intelligence, but that is just funny to me because I am an odd individual. So we are looking downstream. Both launches are open. Look at that. That is probably the least amount of traffic you are going to see in that uh, boat launch parking area there for a while. Now, we through the magic of editing, we are now down by Orahulu, which is at hands we're just gonna call it hands we're we're at hands resort and we are going to be taking a look at the wolf in that area now downstream which is the direction that you see the ice flowing there is it's got a plug meaning the ice is not open all the way to uh good old Lake Poygan. So we're going to take a flight over that way in a little bit. I'm going to speed up the footage here in just a second and we will take a look at that. So you can launch in any of those areas that are south of Fremont as well. So if if you guys want, just spread out and use multiple boat launches. Obviously, that's the, the area towards Lake Poygan is a little bit better. Now here we are flying over towards the quote-unquote ice plug. All right. It is interesting to see how that all jams up. Now, the guy over at Chico's said that this should be probably opening up today on Sunday, the day I'm editing this video and getting things going for you. But I, hard to tell. Things change this time of year, so just be patient with everything. Uh, the better fishing is yet to come. No need to push things. Um, speaking of pushing things, don't forget everybody, like and subscribe to my videos. Um, these will be a little more sporadic and made less often because it's harder for me to get out to these areas on the wolf and the fox. But we'll be getting there. Hopefully we'll get some views and take a look at different things in these areas. And we're going to be thro going through the magic of editing quickly over to Rainbow Park now. And voila, we're in Rainbow Park. Rainbow Park is actually on the Fox River. So once the Wolf River dumps into Lake Poygan, it becomes the Fox River. So here we are over in Rainbow Park. A lot of people out there fishing. I mean, I've seen it so busy that you can almost walk between the boats. It's not quite that busy, but it is busy down there already. What's interesting, if you look on that left side of the screen, we are looking at downstream right now. Most of the boats were concentrating on the seam of water that was between the muddy and clear. So that's kind of an interesting thing you can only see from the drone real easy. So there we are looking downstream. There's the launch in the parking lot right there. And we're going to be panning back upstream here in just a second, looking towards Lake butte -de Now, some of my pronunciations might be a little off and a little weird, so just deal with that. But the walleye fishing is definitely in full swing. If you guys want, stick around. We're just going to do a nice gentle flight in this area. Good luck to everyone going out. Should be a lot of fun this year. Look forward to seeing you on the water. I'll be getting out this week. Cheers and tight lines, everybody. Thanks for watching.